Dear Chair, dear colleagues, good afternoon. We all know that kidney transplantation is the preferred option for patients with end-stage kidney disease. However, remaining for long on the list increases dialysis morbidity and lowers the chances uh, for transplantation. It's likely, oh, it's likely that specific characteristics of patients on the list Uh, affect the prognosis of kidney transplantation. The study included 405 patients who were enrolled on the waiting list for a disease donor kidney graft. Uh, it's a single center study and the characteristics assessed are primary disease, length of stay on dialysis, body mass index, cardiovascular morbidity, and the frequency and cause of temporary exclusion from the list. In our demographics, we can see that our sample are mainly males. 14% uh, were eligible for retransplantation, and 14% uh, were uh, highly sensitized, so they, are, they were ranked on a special list. From the age distribution, you could see that quite a lot of our candidates are elder, and most importantly, about 37% of them are eligible only for an old-for-old -old kidney graft. Regarding the primary disease, the cause of nephropathy was unknown in a large group of patients, 30%, uh, and uh, this uh, increases the uncertainty of uh, a primary disease relapse. And you can see that uh, diabetic nephropathy and especially uh, hypertensive nephrosclerosis uh, are rather underrepresented in our sample. The median time on dialysis was seven years and uh, uh, this shows the delay of the candidates on the list, which is the main problem currently on the list. In contrary, uh, the distribution of uh, overweight and obese uh, wasn't a problem in general in our patients. The distribution is quite normal. Regarding cardiovascular comorbidities, 10% uh, cardiovascular comorbidities affect more than 10% of our pa patients. And the main cause by far uh, was coronary artery disease. And the second cause, uh, about 10%, again, was peripheral artery disease. During their stay on the list, about 13% of patients had to be temporarily excluded from it. And the most frequent reason was cardiovascular disease. It accounts for more than 50% of the cases of temporary exclusion. In particular, coronary angioplasty. Our conclusion was that were that long-term stay of kidney graft candidates on the waiting list is a reality. And uh, reassessment should be considered actually, actually a scheduled reassessment. And this reassessment should be focused on cardiovascular diseases as they comprise both the main comorbidities and the most frequent reason for temporary exclusion from the list. Thank you for your attention.